Pajorica, Reuters, an unidentified man threw an explosive device, probably a hand grenade, at the U.S. Embassy building in Pajorica, the capital of Montenegro, around midnight before blowing himself up, the government said on Thursday. No casualties were reported from the embassy which confirmed a small explosion near its compound. The U.S. State Department said checks were being carried out to ensure all staff were safe. Policemen with submachine guns and police vehicles were out on the streets near the embassy building on Thursday morning after the incident. A Euroearl appropriate state bodies are undertaking measures and activities with an aim of resolving this case and securing full safety and security of the U.S. Embassy Euro Trademark S staff A Euro Montenegro Euro Trademark S Interior Minister, Mevludin Nuhajic, said in a video message, condemning the incident. Montenegro State Television quoting police sources said the attacker was a 43-year-old man born in Serbia and residing in Pajorica. Montenegro police declined to confirm media reports to Reuters. The government, in a tweet, said that about half an hour after midnight a euro or an unknown persona euro had committed suicide with an explosive device. A euro or immediately before, that person threw an explosive device from the intersection near the sports center into the U.S. Embassy compound a euro the device was most probably a hand grenade, it said. The embassy was closed for issuing visas on Thursday and it warned U.S. citizens to stay away until further notice. A Euro or F U.S. Embassy in Pajorica advises U.S. citizens there is an active security situation at the U.S. Embassy in Pajorica A Euro it said on its website. Montenegro is the smallest of all former Yugoslav republics and became the 29th country to join NATO last May. Graphic TMSNRT.R slash 2 Mito.